Welcome back, friends. This is your boy Wings Rule. We are back with another Clan War recap video. So we've been rolling along here really smoothly. I've been working like a crazy person and uh, trying to fit in everything that I got to do. So we're gonna go back here. We got to backtrack on this. This was a hundred percent victory. Um, as you can see, 100% destruction against uh, a turkey clan. So let's get right down and dirty. I gotta give props to my uh, to my supporting staff, uh, Gator, Roe, Monkey, all of you guys, man. Um, you've all been pretty huge for us. Uh, GDH, Clay. I mean, I don't know, I, I, you know, I, I got hurt and then took on this whole new role and now it just seems like it's so, oh, here we go, I was first one out. All right, so this is a Town Hall 11-ish, <laughs> I think. So we're going to see a little bit of a queen walk here coming in from the south. i can probably turn the volume off on that. So I'm going to drop a point on this, uh, or a wizard here with this queen to take out that king uh, real quick. Um, we don't want to waste a whole lot of time getting this queen walk established. So I'm, if I'm remembering correctly, this guy has nothing in his clan castle. If he does, it's not much. Um, but you can see the golem goes down on the left, targets that uh, Tesla. Wizards take care of those structures surrounding him, and wall breakers get everybody into the into the second compartment. Unfortunately, those skeletons did. Oh, look! There was a lone a lowly archer in there protecting his base. So big props to the enemy here. So here we go with a, a crap ton of Valks. It looks like about 14, I think. Raid spell goes down on the uh, entry point. Everybody jumps into the core. Going to see a heal spell and another raid spell. Heal spell is going to come down on that last expo. And uh, there you go. Yeah, they bust through the compartments pretty easily. These Valks are absolutely devastating. Um, yeah. Queen Walk still going. She's going to work on the outside of this base. Still got a heal spell in the bag. Um, it's not really needed yet. Will be soon. But they're, uh, that, those healers are picking up the king right now, so that's pretty good. So, yeah, we're going to move them forward a little bit quicker. Heal spell there, just uh, around the big, the big cluster of defenses to give the queen some time to help... Um, the Valks with the, uh, the sniping of the stuff inside the wall, eh? So here we go. They're just going to work their way around the outside. We're going to speed this up because obviously this is a three-star. Um, Queen's uh, ability hasn't even been used yet. Uh, healers are keeping those Valks going. Going to get around to this Archer Queen, and then the Queen's going to use her ability, shoot her down pretty quick, and yeah, it's lights out. Three stars for the good guys heard that somewhere before yep 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 so that's a uh, seven or eight perfect wars for us so star monkey came in on this town hall 10 um, typical quad quake this time coming in from the south gonna drop a couple of golems one on the bottom left one on the bottom right ish there you go, one on the bottom right, some wizards, some wall breakers to get them into the into the uh, second stage of this attack. And uh, yeah, king goes down, enemy king gets killed, and uh, you're going to see some, some nasty little Valks go down. Along with the Grand Warden directly behind. Took his time on this one. He's trying to psych me out. I think he knew I was going to do a video. Okay, so the Valks are going to go down here. 
I think he's just waiting for a couple of those outside structures to uh, to go away before uh, sending those valks in because uh, keeping them from running around the outside of the base. So as you can see, Warden goes in right away, and then the ability Raid spell goes on the uh, core as, as well as a heal. Wizard Tower in there, so that can do a pretty substantial bit of damage to those Valks all at once. Um, good timing on that for sure. Jump Spell goes in to move uh, those troops into the next compartments. Would have been good to, to pick up that backside in case there was a time issue. But, I mean, he just wrecked this guy. Look at how many Valks are left. Freaking awesome. Warden's still full health. Queen's still nearly full health. Just hopping over the walls here, cleaning up. Nothing to it. Solid attack, just uh, slow approach. <laughs> Fuck my mind up. All right, so oh, here we go. Me again. Wow, I actually had a good war, I guess. All right, so you're gonna see another queen walk. This time, starting from the southwestish. Sorry, I don't know. North, south, east, west. Yes. Okay. So yeah, Queen's going to get moving around this side here. Um, that's That was what I was really starting to stress out because there's no reason for her to go and target anything. I didn't want her to start shooting walls because I wanted her to go to the right side of this base. So I kind of half expected that she might get close to this Inferno Tower. And it was a single, so I was a little bit stressed out. She looked like she might avoid it for a second, but I needed to get her up to full health real quick, just in case. And then I had to use her ability, unfortunately. Um, wasn't really a big deal, honestly, so as you can tell. Uh, Golem's going to go down here kind of walk around the compartment. I don't know. Wizards are going to get dropped here just to clear those structures and get started on the defenses. And uh, Queen's still going to work on the bottom right here, and uh, King's going to break his way in there to try and kill that Queen. Wall Breakers are going to help him get through that compartment, and uh, boom, right through and kill the Queen, and then Valks are going to come down. Um, the idea was to stop them from going to the left, and I think the timing was pretty perfect. Jump Spell goes down into the core, and um, yeah, Raid Spell on the Town Hall. You've got uh, tons of Valks going to work on the Inferno Tower and the Town Hall and two completely full health Golems. And uh, even that uh, Inferno Tower didn't even take those Golems down. So the, the Queen died. The, the aggro got pulled from, from the Queen to the core where all the defenses were uh, attacking those Valks. And uh, yeah. So it's kind of unusual to see a uh, Valk attack where where the Valks and the Golems are left at the end and the Queen is dead, but <clears throat> we'll take it whatever way we get it. Valks are still there. I mean, there's so many tanking troops here, it's not even funny. Uh, it was just a matter of time at that point. <clears throat> still had some wizards in the bag that were cleaning up. This wizard down here in the bottom right here, he's freaking shooting a wall when he could have just walked around to shoot that freaking thing. But whatever. It would have sucked if it would have been a time thing. <clears throat> so that's a three star two for the good guys. Here's uh, well, yours truly again. Dark Knight coming in on some kind of a bunk ass. Re yeah, rejected from the Mr. T collection. I don't know what this is about. Um, pink Walls. Golem, Golem goes down. I mean, I think I just made this up as I was going. It wasn't really, didn't seem... Oh, there's that one archer again. Oh, he's, <laughs> she's she's surviving. She's, she's hurting my Golem. Back off. Okay, so I guess the goal here was just to, uh, to move somewhere, I guess. I don't know. There wasn't a whole lot going on here. There wasn't a lot of defensive areas where the... Giant bombs could be. I did know that this was, was the second attack, so I knew there was a bomb down in the bottom and a bomb on the left. And I think a bomb over by the king. But the wall breakers go in and pretty much negate the jump spell because they actually made it right in. Hogs go down there uh, collapsing on all the defenses around the 
queen and king, keep them alive. Full health golem still, heal spell on the wizard tower on the right, and there's going to be a heal spell on the expo there on the left. And saving one heal spell for just around that wizard tower on the south side of this base. And like basically right around where that uh, air sweeper is. So uh, that was the one spot that there was a bomb that I wasn't really overly concerned about it. Single bomb with full health uh, hogs. That was just about timing. So you can see I dropped a, an archer down there where that giant bomb was. Just to make sure because they were going to be crossing its path. Just to make sure, you know what I mean. So we're going to speed it up. You're going to see a hay spell come down on the left here. And this was uh, just in case they got stuck on that giant bomb. We wanted to make sure that they pushed right through. It was right on the left of that hay spell was a giant bomb. Uh, big backtrack. I'm really, in, yeah, it was weird how that worked out. But three stars anyways. Jesus, I didn't remember having so many. All right, so Tally Gator, my boy, Mr. Gator comes in on this uh, very new Town Hall 9. It looks like a level 3 queen hiding there. Yep. Okay, so you're going to see uh, another uh, another variation of the Go attack, and uh, this is the Go Valk. Um, basically, jump spell is going to go down. Hey, there's that archer again coming out of the uh, clan castle. So, uh, jump spell is going to go down, push everybody into the core here, and then just a rage spell on that wizard tower, and that's it for the center of this base. <clears throat> those level 3 or 4 Teslas weren't really going to do a lot of damage to those Valks in, in the amount of time that they had to actually help defend. Yeah, nice swag poison on nothing, and uh, yeah, this is a friggin' wash. Like, he's got almost all his Valks left. Uh, full health golem. I don't even see any damage been done to it. Uh, again, you know, you can really tell when a, t a team is out to actually play when their bombs are outside their base. And that guy had three, four of his bombs were outside his base. So it is what it is. Some people give up before they even start. So here we go. Clay's going to come in here and take out this Town Hall 9 ish. No queen. Oh, there is a queen. It's a level 2, it looks like. Yeah, it is. So he's going to come in. He's not even going to worry about uh, coming in near the queen because he's got Valks. He's going to work on this nice little queen walk, too. Uh, forgot about this attack. I like guys trying new things when they know that... Uh, that the bait. You see how he dropped a couple of Valks behind that golem? That really helps clean up those structures so you don't have to backtrack. And it also helps to take out the skelly traps and and uh, break them through the wall faster, except that they decided they wanted to target something further away. But nonetheless, the healers are there. Um, it's kind of like a golem push to the center because the healers didn't even target the queen to protect. But a rage spell on the core... And another raid spell leaving the core. Um, looks like both golems are pretty well full health. Yeah, there you go. There's that raid spell on the, the north of the base. A um, couple of builder huts in the corners. Looks like uh, he had already planned to take care of those. Look at that little sneak attack. That wizard popped in right at the backside there to uh, make sure to put an end to that archer tower before it got to do any damage to anything. And they're going to redirect, that one wizard redirects and goes over, picks up that builder hut for him. That was pretty lucky. And uh, yeah, once this Tesla goes down, I think they might even zip around to the outside and go get that builder hut on the other side. Oh, they would have, but it got exploded. So there you go. That is... Uh, that's another three star. Good job, Clay. Really sorry, guys, that I haven't been putting out videos and uh, being around as much as normal. It's just so much going on, man. But we're here. We're doing a video. Gator comes in here. Look at that. Such a freebie. Like a gift. 
a gift double bomb hit in one shot that's pretty awesome uh, double golems coming in on the uh, south of the base with some wizards uh, stretching out the uh, outsides of these golems to uh, create that funnel to the center Valks go in no delay on the Valks making sure that they don't go wandering around because there's no structures ahead of them jump spell onto the into the core there rage spell meeting those Valks and it is friggin crunch nice little heal there and a rage spell on the upper wizard tower should pretty much uh, seal the deal on this come on there we go there you go they're gonna blaze through that wall now and another swag uh, spell in the bag he's trying to kill that cannon with the uh, poison didn't I think it might have taken some damage off I don't know that golem is there standing beside the queen just fucking going to work that's pretty awesome um, friggin easy three star for Gator he just showed this guy how it's done so yeah we are now a level 9 guild clan here and um, pumping out the winds man Dark Knight comes in on a Town Hall 8 no Town Hall 9 uh, another go ho um, I think coming on the left side of this base here Oh, my bad. Right side. I fought a similar base there recently, and I think I got confused. So it's nice to take out that archer tower on the top without even getting a shot onto those wizards. That's why we spread those golems out a little bit, you know what I mean? To uh, Don't drop them like doom doom right on top of each other because it doesn't give you any protection on the sides. So you're only being able to take out the structures in the middle, which is what causes you to not have a funnel. Those middle structures need to be there for those troops to have something to go to. So Hogwall behind the heroes, and um, yeah, it's it's just uh, some well placed heels on the left, one on the right, <clears throat> and then really just holding on to that last heel because in between the cannon and mortar on the left here is another giant bomb. So that's going to pretty well seal the deal on that. They're going to run right into that heel and they're going to turn around and they're going to beat the hell out of those um, skeletons and then the king. And yeah, pretty easy takedown. Not as much left over at the end as I would have preferred, but one hog and a golem take down that king. So that's freaking awesome. Three star for the good guys, and uh, that's pretty much a wrap as far as Town Hall 9s are concerned. Um, what else did we do? Star Monkey here, Monkey King came in with his mini, and um, yeah, I'm going to speed this up a little bit. This attack kind of goes a little longer. <laughs> he even poisoned a single archer. I fucking love this guy. <laughs> Awesome. Wizard wall behind the uh, golem. Wall breakers come in to get him into the core. And yeah, it's it's kind of bye bye birdie once these hogs come out. Oh, right on top of a giant bomb. Bitching. There you go. Heal spell. Another heal spell on the. Uh, oh, trickling in these hogs here from the backside here. Another heal spell is going to come down on this mortar on the bottom right. There you go. And yeah. Walk in the park, buddy. Easy, breezy, beautiful. Even hogs in the CC to uh, help take up the clearing, clean up. It's nice when you got so much extra time on your hands with uh, Town Hall 9s. What do we got here? Achilles goes after Town Hall 8 here. Again, you know, not leaving anything to mystery here nothing in the center so as long as you can get those hogs in there you go look you even trickled trickled in and got a freebie on a bomb I think I uh, wasted five five hogs here but the hogs are gonna come in and just uh, basically dismantle this base one giant bomb I didn't get on the, the little uh, s scouting mission here heal in the bag poison in the bag Wizards in the bag. 
<laughs> fucking everything in the bag. Really, I could have held on to a lot more. I could have, I could have held on to the CC. But yeah, just a pretty easy game some days. Row came in here, did an attack on number 11. Some level 2 dragons, takes out a Town Hall 8. It's nice when you got a nice clear line to those two air defenses. You see, there's no, uh, there's no cause for any you know, walkabouts to go around because it's got a nice square base here. So it's just a matter of creating that funnel, getting it started. Builder Hut goes down and the rest of these uh, flying creatures are going to fly over the top of the, the well-created funnel. And uh, they're going to just fan right across this space like a tidal wave of friggin' fire-breathing dragons. Balloons are going to come in and help with those air defenses and soak up some of those bombs and the air bombs and uh look at that and they're just eating those bombs up and they're still going those level one bombs don't really get you anywhere we're just just so close to taking out that wizard tower but solid dragon attack by the roman haven't uh haven't seen anything from you today on this uh in this war so that was it's good to have a, a nice easy three star here for you by uh t on a town hall eight Nice job. And yeah, uh, everybody really contributed to this win. I mean all these all the low level town hall sixes, fives, um, you know, that hit. GDH we'll do one from you, my this is his uh his baby account, so he's gonna go Oh boy. There we go. <laughs> Minion on the right. Love it. Uh yeah. Just some simple giants coming in here. Ooh, wall breaker fail. Didn't do it twice though. Push those giants into the base. You're gonna see a heal spell coming up. Valk's gonna go in there to kill that king. Yeah, no no jump spells at town hall eight. <laughs> uh but that heal spell did last quite some time, so that helped uh, push those troops through the, uh, the walls. And yeah, here we go. A couple of trickled-in hogs here. So this is a go Vaho, really. Uh, some clan castle hogs to uh, help clean out those uh, defenses while they're occupied by the meat shield slash red-headed fireballs. Um, they're as good of a meat shield as anything out there right now, really, because they've got such a high HP, but such a nasty attack. Um, poison left in the bag here. Again, like, there's this, yeah, there's no clan castle troops. It really kind of shuts down the whole need for poisons in your bag. But this was a first attack on this base, so can't fault them. Even though you can scout that shit. I'm not saying nothing. Just saying. Anyway, so uh, that's a three star. I'm going to shut this down. This is, uh, it's been a pretty good video. Really excited about how, uh, how things are still all just running real smoothly with the, with the clan. And frig, we're approaching quickly on level 10. So we're just about maxed out at our level at this point. So great job, guys. Um, Everybody's just really they're they're doing the basics 100% well, so it's pretty awesome. All right, so wings rule here, wings rule clan always recruiting. So uh, yeah, stop by check us out. All right, keep clashing. Peace. <laughs>